Great publicity for this game in the Emirates FA Cup. I'm Martin Tyler and this is Alan Smith. Yeah, good afternoon, Martin. Looking forward to this. The papers have been full of it this week and I hope we're not disappointed. Today's game, Manchester United against Leicester City. This is then the Manchester United lineup. Well, we've put this up as 4 4 2, but as you can see, there are three conventional midfield players and one just in front behind the main two attackers. Yeah, and that lad, I mean, he does like to get forward. I don't think he'd be so happy dropping into central midfield. He'll want to try and get in the box and, and join those lads up top if he can. This is the Leicester City lineup. Kasper Schmeichel starts in goal. Mark Albrighton starts. And now the shot! He's missed the target by quite a lot in the end. You watched Patrick Vieira a lot, didn't you, uh, Alan? I just wonder whether you'd see in Paul Pogba, fellow Frenchman, of course, the same kind of uh, assets. Yeah, the shades of that. And uh, once he gets on the ball, once he opens his legs, he's a tough man to stop. And I think he will be here. Predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. And here's De Rossi. And it's going to be his throw here. Mark Albright. Plenty of space out wide and they're going to use it. Taking on the defenders. Pogba. Daniele De Rossi. So we'll restart with a throw-in. Mark Albright. Striding forward, purposefully. Return pass. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Now Bale crosses it. Easy save for Schmeichel. possession to the opposition now it's unlike him really to play the ball straight to the opposition well there's one for him to chase in behind now this is an interesting attack on the move and able to cut out the pass still got a bit to do but this is promising Quick change of possession here. Pogba. He's looking for the cross. Put into the middle. Good defensive clearance there. Telemans. Ricardo Pereira. Maguire and Didi. A lot of defenders between them and the goal, but they still got the ball. He's got his shot off now. Keeper controls it, never looked like bouncing off him. Yeah, it made it look easy, but his positioning did that for him. Guiding the pass through. Now it's offside. <laughs> quick witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept there. Proper tackle that. Fuchs. Telemans. And he shoots. He's tried to hit this one too hard, Alan, hasn't he? Oh, I think he shanked it, Martin. Miles off target in the end. Ricardo Pereira. Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. Vardy. Trying a bit too hard, trying to force the pass, and it went to, straight to an opponent. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Really strong tackle, and the ball's gone out for a throw. Telemans. Simple save for David De Gea. 
lost the ball in a bad area. Shot off. It was interesting, the press conference leading up to this game, wasn't it? The manager referring to the match between these two teams earlier when it finished as a draw and suggesting... And shoots! And that goalkeeper can just saunter out and pick that up. And De Rossi only able to give the ball away, really. Fuchs with a cross. Simple save for David De Gea. Indeedy. Well, that is half time, and the score is nil. Manchester United. Off Players have had their chance to assess brought for them. The start now of the second half of them in the Emirates FA Cup. Yeah, interesting to uh, know what the two managers would have said in those half-time dressing rooms, but I'm expecting a good clash here. Wender was absolutely on top of his game. He's gone too early, he's offside. Gay. Patricia Gay. Javi Martinez. What we get to see. Of course, the assistants don't. Whether that'll change down the years, uh, I'm not sure. But anyway, the replay here shows he's got it right. He has. I mean, there was no real goal scoring chance, but uh, the defence would be pleased that uh, their organisation caught him off. He might be through. Bale! How did he save that? Uh, he's one of the best in the business from those kind of situations. Absolutely brilliant. It's time for some fresh legs here. Gareth Bale. Guilty Sigurdsson. Intercepted well. A great chance to go in. Well, the kind of save that you make after training for that kind of situation from close range. Put the corner in the middle. Oh, that's good defending. Put it where he hoped his teammates could attack it. And that's deflected behind. It will be a corner. In goes the corner. With the game being played in one half of the pitch at the moment. The team with possession finding it hard, though, to get into areas where they're going to score a goal. Oh, he spotted the pass and cut it out. Well, the word average comes to mind about his first half. What do you think, Alan? Didn't quite have the impact I was expecting at the start, but time to remedy that. Aim for Gareth Bale, cleared away by the defender. Just a little nudge to nudge you in the direction of what's coming up on EA Sports for you. Our coverage of the Premier League fixture for Manchester United. They'll be facing Fulham away from home. Yeah, it's got a good feel about it, that one. Joining you in the gantry for it. How about Leicester City's next game? He's in, slipped through. They can't stop him. Here's a chance, the goalkeeper exposed. Well, Tottenham Hotspur, a very well-run club financially, but they've certainly dipped their toe into the water here. Well, he doesn't come cheap, about £60 million, but he is the kind of player that can make a difference. Saw that coming and intercepted. James Ward-Prowse. Just a mistake, really. He's not even asked too much of the opponent. It's just a mishit pass. Looking to use the full width of the pitch in this attack. Great interception. Maguire. Ndidi. Neatly intercepted. He's got to keep the ball here under some pressure. Out of play for a throw. Now, this is interesting whether the manager is just going to switch things around a little bit. Number two, Danny Simpson. 
Drills it in. Leicester ready to make this change. The header on target, but never looking as though it was going to get the better of this goalkeeper. No, he's under a bit of pressure to head the ball and uh, didn't really get the direction at all on it. Oh, what a chance they had there to pick out the right pass. Just couldn't manage it. Oh, it's still goalless here, not much time left. What about their next game, Alan? Well, Manchester United go up against Fulham. It's been a hard match out here, but certainly they haven't reached the levels they have in previous games. Seven minutes to go. Oh, what a chance, but the interception has denied them that. A bit predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. Into the attacking third. Going forward well. And oh, that's broken up by the defender before the cross could come in. It's unlike him, Rip. And now the shot! The ball's loose. Oh, what a miss! In a goalless game, what a chance! Yeah, that was the match-winning moment right there, right then. Manchester United want to make a change now. 88 minutes played here. Maguire. We've got two added minutes. There will be a minimum of two minutes of added time. And it's Wilson. If it's Manchester United to win the game, they've got to get it now. Intercepted well. We go on into extra time. United. Well, the kick off, pitch. and we're off and running in extra time here. Daniel Di De Rossi to be replaced by. Got his foot in to cut out the pass. Maybe just missed, kicked it a little bit there, and pass goes straight to the opposition. Simpson. Simpson. They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. It's a very good interception. It goes out wide again. United fans doing all they possibly can to spur their team on to a winner. Gareth Bale. This is Gareth Bale in full cry. Strong, powerful clearance. Break quickly when they get possession. Trying to get the ball in behind. Just the keeper to beat. Trying to get behind the defenders to get in a good cross. Great place to win it back. And the verdict on added time is two minutes. And on the bench, some activity for Leicester. It's a change here, and I think it might be a tactical one. And that's... Uh... It is the start of the second period of extra time. Ndidi. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Well, this could be dangerous in a wide position. You can see what he was trying to do with the cross, but it's a goal kick.
It's Ward Prowse. Christian Vassogog. Oh, he spotted the pass and cut it out. Still time. Eight minutes to go. Manchester United can attack in a wide area now. Fabulous clearance. Gilfie Sigurdsson. United couldn't keep it. And there was danger, but he's cleared it. It's Jamie Vardy. It's Matuidi. Matuidi! Got in the way. And a big clearance. Out of danger and out of play in the end. They've got the ball back. The interceptor got it for them. Deep into this second period of extra time now. Just three minutes to go. They might have played him in here. Rojo. Blocked off the pass there. We've got two added minutes. There will be a minimum of two minutes. Can he clear his lines now? Just lost the ball, United. Well, the pressure all on the penalty takers now because we're going to... And the first man up is ready to go. Beat the goalkeeper well in this penalty shootout. It's time to step up. Oh, it's straight at the goalkeeper and he hasn't dived out of the way. Excellent penalty. Not worrying at all about the pressures of the shootout. Ready to go, the next penalty taker. And he scores his penalty. So next up to take the penalty. Kasper Schmeichel, wonderful. So it's his turn now from the spot. Oh dear, when you try that and it doesn't work, you do look as though egg is all over your face. So if they lose this, he's not going to be popular in that dressing room. That's a good penalty, isn't it? Well, all the pressure is on the kick-taker here. If he doesn't score, they'll lose the game. No, they've lost. Oh, there'll be no consoling him after that. He stepped up, he was brave, but just couldn't do the damage for his team.
our main feature today on EA TV. Two great clubs. It's coming up for you live. Hello again, everyone. We're enjoying this new stadium, the new home of Tottenham Hotspur. We being myself, Martin Tyler, and Alan Smith alongside me. It's a great venue, and of course, it's a wonderful match. The last game at White Hart Lane, the old ground, was against Manchester United, and it's Manchester United who are here at Tottenham's new home today. Well, I've been waiting a long time to come along here, Martin, and I think you'd agree it's... Well, <laughs> offside by the proverbial mile. Yeah, an easy one for the linesman, that clearly offside. Ericsson. Winks. Shot on. Kept his concentration, the goalkeeper, and because of that, kept hold of the ball. Yeah, he seems to fill the goal, this lad. He's quite an imposing keeper. We have a high-scoring team, the highest, in fact, in the league, against the side with the best defence. It really should be a terrific contest. Yeah, it does make for a fascinating match-up here. Who's going to get the better of who? But a space to go forward into with the ball. Just lost their way at the crucial moment of that counter-attack, and they've lost the ball. Christian Eriksen. It's Harry Winks. That's an easy cut-out for the opposition, saw the pass coming. Manchester United on the move here. Could get a great chance to go in front, and they have done. Oh, that could be a big goal, because this side knows how to defend a lead. The goal then for Manchester United. Well, it was a great delivery into the box from that left-hand side. It's where they look dangerous. And well, here's the goal again. He's not the easiest of managers to work for, I know that. But his players are doing what he demanded beforehand now. Manchester United with the lead. It's Harry Winks. Christian Eriksen. Son. A bit of a sortie forward for Spurs here from a wide position. Out into the wide areas now. Now, this is an interesting attack. And they get it away. Excellent interception. Strong challenge. Son. Neatly intercepted. Son. Oh, he spotted the pass and cut it out. Oh, the crowd urging him to have a shot. Hit it hard, but not very true. Iliara Mendy. Felipe Luis. On the attack here, Son, excellent interception. Felipe Luis. And now the shot! A bit predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. Well, they're building steadily here, working away. He could cross it now. Hey, looking for teammates in the middle. And that will clear the danger. And shoots! Oh, he's hit it. Too high.
Garner. Put into the middle. It's a miss at a significant time. Will that come back to haunt him? They could have been pulling ahead. Yeah, you see it so often. But uh, they are still in charge of this match. Now Nacho. Iliara Mendy. Not long to go in the first half, and Manchester United just have the edge over Spurs. Yeah, the United manager will be pretty pleased with the way that his players have performed. He'll just be urging once they get to half time for them to keep the concentration. Good power in that punch away by the goal. And here's the shot. He's blocked that well. And the referee seeing that as a foul. It is a free kick for the referee. A decision here, Alan, whether to book him or not. It's an all not. Yeah, and you get some... Gone for the header, and we love to see that, especially you, Alan, but you could head it much, much better than this one. Well, you've got to be committed to those headers, and he wasn't quite. Well, he could be in. Got to keep his nerve here. Well, he took no chances there. It's a corner. <laughs> in goes the corner. Bar's a comfortable save for the keeper from the header. Well, it's not the most powerful header you'll see this season or even in this match. Didn't time it. Song. Ericsson. He's one-on-one -on -one with the goalkeeper. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Test of his control now. Here's Winks, Christian Eriksen. Okay. The referee has indicated there will be a He's got his shot off now. Tried to find the winning ticket in the raffle, but a couple of numbers short. Yes, he took it early, though. Christian Eriksen. Eriksen. Felipe Luis. a good cross that's hit the bar and it's still in play it's a goal for Tottenham and it's the equaliser a well deserved one too you could see it coming that was an amazing shot very difficult technique and the goalkeeper left helpless well, he's rooted to the spot. He flew past him at some pace. Well, the referee has blown for half-time at 1-1. Substitution for Manchester United. Coming off the and pitch. setting the ball rolling for the second half, Manchester United. Coming onto the pitch, number 10, Gareth Bale. Gomez. Garner. De Rossi. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Gay. Got to pass the ball a bit better than this if they're going to make progress, giving it straight away. Real good contest between these two as they jostle for possession. Coming in towards Kane. Simple save for David De Gea. Tottenham given the throw. Davidson Sanchez. Iliara Mendy. Substitution for Spurs coming up. Just working away to try and find an opening. Uh, what about Manchester United's next game, Alan? They're playing Fulham in the next match. And uh, I think one goal's going to decide it. Well, that's straightforward for the goalkeeper. 
They're never shy of buying, are they, Barcelona? And they bought again here. Well, it's a fairly big transfer figure, £40 million or thereabouts. And uh, I think this lad won't be affected by it, though. He'll uh, be able to concentrate on his football and show us what he can do. Nacho Fernandez. Iliara Mendy. Son. It's Harry Winks. Now, can he take them on? Made the tackle. So there'll be a throw now after the tackle. Just looking at the tactics of this match, maybe this substitution will hold the key. It's Harry Winks. Plenty of space out wide, and they're going to use it. Looking to use the full width of the pitch, but it didn't quite come off that time. And now he's looking for some support. Good challenge here. Decision is a throw. It was a fair tackle. Came the target. Defender did well to get plenty of power, but not too much direction. We've given it straight to the opposition. Christian Eriksen. Really getting at the opposition this far up the pitch now. Good defensive clearance there. Oh, time to get the cross now. Well, then it goes. That's a good goal for them. And they have been playing well. No one can really complain about them taking the lead here. They have been much the better side. And it's a fine piece of finishing. Not looking good for Manchester United. They are trailing in this game. Quick-witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept the Substitute ready for Tottenham Hotspur. Iliara Mendy. Given away by Christian Eriksen. Guided through. Werner. That looked really threatening. But in the end, it was a bit of a damp squib because no-one could connect with the cross. Maybe too much defending from Tottenham here, Alan. Well, one or two boos from the supporters. They're not happy with this negative approach, but I don't think they'll mind if it does the job. Iliara Mendy. It's lovely to watch the ball being passed with this sort of level of play, Alan. It's the understanding, the technique, the movement, the weight of pass that's been so pleasing on the eye. Bale got the ball, and they're going at the opposition with speed. This could be the leveller. And yes, he's done it! Oh, what late drama! Question is, will there be a winner in this match? Well, they were caught out here by this quick counter-attack against the run of play. Yeah, I mean, they had to uh, stick together there and come under a lot of pressure, but with the pace in the team, that was always likely. Substitution for Spurs coming up. Song on the move and able to cut out the pass. Good link up. Ericsson and shoots. And it blocked. And that is quite a wild effort at goal. Although he got good contact on the ball. Number two. And Manchester United are going to make a substitution here. Number 24. Look at the clock now. Three minutes to go. And that's a pass that's gone astray, out of play. Iliara Mendy. And they've got a man out wide. Whipped in from the wide area. Compliment the defender, but not the player trying to cross it. The well, signal's gone up for two minutes. There will be a minimum Iliara Mendy. Gula. Now Nacho. Well, the wide man can show his skills here. Werner! It's come off the goalkeeper, still in play. Good clearance. That's it, level pegging.
Well, we should have a fine game for you today. I'm Martin Tyler. Alan Smith is with me. Welcome to you all. The match today sees Fulham versus Manchester United. Your Fulham lineup today. Number 25, Sergio Rico. Number 16. Clearly no flash in the pan for Leicester City, the fairy story of the 15-16 season, the most unlikely champions, an incredible tale, and they're at it again. Well, we're well past the halfway mark in this season, aren't we? And they've still got a, a great show to finishing in a Champions League spot. I mean, if they could see it through, what a huge difference it would make to this football club. Now we can check on the Fulham lineup. Andre Schuller starts with Lazar Markovic on the flanks. And leading the line today is Luciano Vieto. This is. He's one on one with the goalkeeper. He's got his shot off now. Tried to find the winning ticket in the raffle, but a couple of numbers short. Yes. He took it early, though. Tom Kearney. Vieto. Good reading of the play by the defender. Manchester United have got a decent result in their last game. It was away from home and they drew against Tottenham Hotspur. Yeah, I thought in the 2-2, the defence was a little slack. If they tighten up, I think they'll win here. Spotted that well and intercepted. I think the wide man's got a chance here. There's space out near the touchline. It's a shot now! Tried to get the right contact there, but couldn't quite manage it. Yeah, he's ended up looking a little bit silly, but uh, if you don't try those things, you're never going to succeed, are you? Andre Schürrle. Almost waiting for this kind of situation, Andre Schürrle. Plenty of width for the team to attack into. Into the box it goes, along the ground. Good work by the goalkeeper. Bit of space for him now out on the wing. Zambo and Gisa. You can see what he was trying to do just stretch the opposition by getting the ball out wide, but it's gone out for a throw. Zambo and Gisa. Shots on here. He's blocked that well. Maybe the counter-attack is on here. With great vision here. Breaks really in the clear now. In on goal. Well, he's in the clear, and the goalkeeper has saved it and saved his side. Well, his defenders should be thanking him because they left him exposed, didn't they? But he answered the call. Must take the lead here. No, he's missed it. How is this still level? Oh, you'll be thinking about that one, tossing and turning in bed tonight. That was a bad miss. Chambers. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. And now the shot! And that's gone out for a corner, clear cut. And an opportunity now, maybe. Corner's taken. It's a brave effort, really, in amongst the players to get the header in, but off target, way off target. Yeah, not his best effort, that's for sure. There's a chance for a double for the team that are the visiting team today. Had a good win against this side that they're visiting in the uh, other match between the two clubs earlier in the season. But I'm sure the hosts are really determined to... And shoots! The chance did open up for that kind of shot. Well, if you don't have a go. United trying to get down to their game, to business as usual. And find some space here on the flanks. It's one matter crossing. Defended well. Tackle here. Andre Schürrle. They might have played him in here. I think he saw the look from the other player. And... Markovic! 
powerful drive, close enough to suggest. Have another go, son. Yeah, strong shot. I think the keeper saw it coming all the way, though. Throw in to come. Chambers. Zambo and Gisa. Tom Kearney. It's a very good interception. Opportunity in a wider area. This could be a chance. Tight. And the keeper had to be brave. Here's Gray. He'll need to try and get...
the ball back now. Zambo and Gisa. Well, here's an opportunity with the ball over the top. Attacking team not happy about that offside call, but we can see it again here. Well, he is quick, this lad, and he can afford to give himself another yard. I think he's got the beating of these defenders in a race. Well, will be two added minutes. There will be a minimum of two minutes. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Left the defenders trailing now. Here's a chance. They can't stop him. Well, they managed to get out of harm's way then because it looked as though... So it's half-time and we're still waiting for that first goal. Well, we'll... well... Setting the ball rolling for the second half, Manchester United. Andre Schürrle. Now, can he take them on? Now, Wilson. Setting up to shoot and getting encouragement from the crowd to do so. Goal, Manchester United open the scoring here. They've been doing all of the pushing, what a good finish. Came close to goalkeeper, actually did get a touch on it, but I think it was a pretty good effort to do that much. Well beaten, really. Yeah, I don't think you can blame the keeper, Martin. He's looking at his defenders, why was the lad given so much space? Trying to find a way through here, probing away. Danger to the opposition from Schürrle. Mata. Daniele De Rossi. Lost control, and you get in trouble for that. Well, that episode is going to lead to a yellow card from the referee. Well, look at the ref, he reached for his pocket straight away. No uh, hesitation from him. Well, that's good defending. Daniele De Rossi. That's good support play from his teammates. And now the shot! Andre Schürrle. Well, he was in the right place at the right time to cut it out. Well, it will be a throw-in. Well, there's still time to hit back in this game, and they're going to try and do it with a substitute. And it's been an hour of very good football here. We've still got 30 more minutes to go, and I'm sure we're going to enjoy that as well. They can spread the play now. Chance to cross it. I think the opposition looked as though they believed they'd get through them, but they haven't, and now they can get on the ball and play. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. Saw the goal and went for it. And the goalkeeper with a textbook save and keeps the ball in his grasp. The extremely talented and exciting Paul Pogba He's got personality as well as skill. Maybe on his way to slipping it through. And the blocks the cross. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. And it's a shot now! Oh, he spotted the pass and cut it out. Going forward well. He's cut it out. Schürrle. 
Zambo and Gisa. And shoots! Well, he hit it well enough. Yeah, maybe just a bit off balance there, actually. Now, this is an interesting attack. No time for an extra touch after the tackle. It's out of harm's way. And he bangs it away. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Delivered into the box. Reaching for it a little bit with the header. And that's the expected result. Back to the training ground, I think. Manchester United closing in on victory here. Yeah, and they've been positive. They're actually trying to get another goal. The countdown is on. We're into nine minutes now. One or two players are warming up for the home team. We'll see who comes on. So not much time left at all. What does this mean, Alan, for their next game? Yeah, a full and goal up against West Ham United. After this, well, nobody's played well for them. They've got to do better. Well, that's good defending. They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. Well, that's the keeper's ball from the moment the cross left his foot. Made a quick interception. Well, there's a big support here for them. And those supporters want to see just a little bit more in the time that remains. Well, there's always pressure on you when you're playing in front of a big crowd, your own fans, and the players have shown a few... Shots off! They're running out of time. It's a corner to come. Swung in, good defending at the front post, but not such a good corner. That's the referee's decision, two added minutes. Here is Babel. It's an excellent cross. Far too close, the cross to the keeper. Well, there's the final whistle, and it's a win here for Manchester United. Goal scorers, as you well know, get lots of attention. Let's give the defenders some praise today. Oh, most definitely. And the back four will get credit, but you do defend as a team. And I think the, the midfielders, the way that they, they protected in front of that back four was, uh, was vital. I think the wide man's got a... Thank you.